welcome to javainterviewquestions.com and today we will see one of the important questions and mostly asked interview question by interviewers for 0 to 3 years of experience first what is i mean let's see what is the difference between method overriding and method overriding in java this is one of the important questions please listen carefully to this video first point method overloading and method overriding in the method overloading the first point is method overloading occurs within the same class overloading will do overloading in the same class but coming to the overriding method overriding involves two classes one is super class and the other is subclass one is super class and other is subclass and the next point second one method in method overloading since it involves only one class it does not require any inheritance concept i repeat once again since method overloading requires only one class it does not require inheritance concept coming to method overriding method overriding occurs between the super class and subclass so inheritance is involved in method overriding third point method overloading in method overloading return type need not be the same but in method overriding return type must be the same i repeat once again this point in overloading we can have different return types for methods but in method overriding even return type should be same fourth point parameters must be different when we do overloading parameters must be same when we do method overriding i repeat once again parameters must be different in method overloading parameters must be same in method overriding and uh, next point static polymorphism can be achieved using method overloading we call this method overloading even as static polymorphism and uh, dynamic polymorphism can be use achieved using method overriding so this is one of the important point here we achieve method static pol polymorphism in java using method overloading and we achieve dynamic polymorphism in java using method overriding and the last point is in method overloading one method can't hide, hide the other method in method overloading one method can't hide the other but then in method overriding subclass method hides that of the superclass method in method overriding subclass method hides the superclass method and these are the important differences for method overloading and method overriding thanks for watching this video for more interview questions log on to